Hello everybody, this is Dan Bigman, your GPR professor from LearnGPR.com. Uh, I'm out here doing a little experiment today. I'm always trying to collect some new data, new sites, new conditions, um, different kind of subsurfaces, different orientations of buried you know, targets, whether it's utilities, rebar, graves, archaeological you know, features, whatever. Um, always trying to experiment. <clears throat> and I just wanted to... You know, I get laughed at sometimes. I always get laughed at. Let me not say sometimes. I usually get laughed at. But um, for this thing I get laughed at is uh, I tell people to recalibrate their survey wheel, right? The importance of recalibrating your survey wheel is that you uh, uh, get more locational, better locational accuracy. And, uh, and I've talked to people who have never calibrated a survey wheel on their system at all. And so I just wanted to show this because I think it's important. This is a 30 meter transect. Okay, all the way down there. You see that cone down there? I'm going from a line down there, and I'm walking to a cone right here. Okay? So I'm walking from down there all the way to a cone right here. And I want to show you how accurate this is. So you can see, okay, you can see where my line is, that yellow line. Sorry. You can see where my yellow line is. And now you can see where my black hash mark is. Let me move this cord out of the way. This black hash mark right here, 30, okay, 30 meters, and I got within, I would say, one centimeter, okay? And the reason that that happened is you calibrate the survey wheel correctly. Uh, it just makes your data so much more accurate as far as its locational distribution. Right? If I didn't cert calibrate it, let's say I was you know, working on this kind of grass or whatever over here and it was a little bit muddy and I started there and then I didn't recalibrate it to this, you know, to this ground surface, to this dry um, kind of concrete, then it would be off. It would be, it would be further off. But luckily, I listen usually to what I say myself. And, so, uh, and in this case, I did it and obviously it shows just how accurate it can be. So within one centimeter. So 30 meters long of a transect. I came within one centimeter, maybe one and a half centimeters of that line. So, mm, I love it. Anyway, I wish you nothing but the best. Have a great week. And uh, if you haven't gone over to learngpr.com, go over, put your name and email address in, and you'll get these videos into your inbox every week. And if you haven't done so yet, subscribe to this channel, and you'll get notified once we put out a new video. If this was helpful, share it around, click like on this, and I will see you next time.